Hi, I'm Mrs. Whalen. I'm the math coach at Martin Gregorian Elementary School. And today is December 5th and we've decided to honor National Computer Science Week with an hour of code. All students are participating this year in our second annual event in honor of that week. So we bring this alive to the students so they can be engaged in computer coding, whether it's in kindergarten, our pre-readers, all the way up to our fifth graders. Today you're in the STEM room at Gregorian and um, you've just witnessed our fourth grade coding crew that has worked with one of um, our volunteers and they've learned how to code and built several games. Uh, the Smart Fox game is sort of like Pac-Man because there are bears that try to get you that are like the ghosts in Pac-Man and you're trying to get apples and tacos. And for each apple and taco that you get, you get a point and then the we call them fox bonks in the game, which is when the fox bonks into the mayor. When that happens, it's sort of like a negative point, and uh, when you get like a certain amount of bonks, it kind of cancels out like here. Mm -hmm. We do uh, mostly everything as a group. Yeah. We all think of the idea together, and then yeah. uh, Mr. Paisa helps us with what events and controls and things we have yeah. to do. We actually based it off of a different Get the first game we made, which was called Dizzy Cat. Uh, which was it was, cat. Yeah, it was a cat trying to get apples, and there was nothing trying to get it, but yeah. Which was a game that so, Mr. Heise thought of, but then we decided that we needed something more advanced with, like, when we got better at coding, to also have something to do with our school, because we're, like, partnered regarding the Smart Fox kind of school, mm -hmm. so... We wanted to do something that sort of represented our school and yeah. a fun game to play. It's pretty fun because you get to like basically decide what everyone and everything does in the game. So to begin, most of the, the, the things we did, we do the one green flag flip. Uh, then we set the volume to 50 so it's not uh, too loud. Our fifth graders were very eager and engaged to play the game that the fourth graders had built and the fourth graders felt so on top of the world because they were able to share their expertise with students that were older than them. I'm really nervous because fifth graders are older than us and like being able to teach them something is yeah, it's new and kind of cool but it's also a bit nerve-wracking. And the game is kind of easy, so mm, it was really yeah. easy to teach them. Martin Gregorian is awesome because uh, it has a cool STEM room, and uh, it, and it has much, um, good teachers. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and I feel like you get to they like give you time to hang out with your friends mm -hmm. and things. So yeah, it's kind of nice, and I feel like. They let us work as a team a lot, mm -hmm. which I like because I like group projects, mm -hmm. things like that. Yeah. 